Tyra, thank you. We're following breaking news right now. As we mentioned just a little while ago, a number of crashes and slide offs across the area. This one specifically in Broad Ripple. Yes, yeah, Sierra Hignite is there live for us. Sierra, tell us exactly where you are and, and what you're seeing. Yeah, so this crash, it happened on Westfield Boulevard, as you mentioned, in Broad Ripple. Now, I'll show you what it looks like right now. Crews are currently trying to tow the car away. That's the silver vehicle right there. Now, when we arrived, the car was already on the side of the road here. So we don't know if it ever was actually in the water or if anyone uh, was inside in the water. Uh, right now, the only thing that we see here is this tow truck and them trying to now tow it to take it away. But if you look inside of the vehicle, you can see it looks like the airbag was deployed. It looks like there's some damage uh, to the windshield of the car. And it looks like there was some type of collision at some point to the front of the vehicle. You can see quite a bit of damage done there. Now, we we don't have a lot of details as to how this crash happened, if they hit a tree, if they hit another vehicle, how many people were involved in this accident. We are working to talk with IMPD right now who is on the scene to figure out what exactly happened. But right now uh, there is traffic being diverted in the area. People are turning around as this tow truck is here trying to get this car um, away. We. Uh, Okay, we just got an update from police. Uh, we are told that it is a slide off that a female is being checked out by medics, but is not seriously injured. That is the latest uh, from police. So again, waiting to get an update on what exactly happened, what led to this crash, but we know one person is being checked out, not serious injuries. We're going to continue to monitor this situation uh, and give you an update as soon as we get it. Reporting live, I'm Sierra Hignite, Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.